if you have a SC430, if you have a car with the rear differential, this model, uh, probably an LS430 or SC430 or LS400, take a look and do this right so you don't damage any components under the car. And, you know, it's all, always a, a great safety feature to know how to properly jack up your car. So here we go. Just going to go under. Show you where I have placed the hydraulic jack, which is right under where the differential is located in the middle of the car. Again, I'm just going to go back. Uh, there is no information out there. There is really no information online, no documents, no pictures. So this is the main jack point. Make sure you put a nice thick rubber right on top of your uh, jack plate so you don't damage anything. I'm using a very thick uh, hard rubber so you're always safe there. Jack up the car. Just going back so you can see exactly where it is between the two exhaust pipes and uh, place the jack stands once you have your car lifted uh, it's not safe to you know just use that area and leave the car sitting unless you just want to you know lift it up for just a few minutes uh, to replace tires do a quick job but if you planning to keep it keep the car up for you know for a day or two you know or working on a project definitely have some jack stand support and the jack stands should should go the best place uh to place the jack stands as you can see are at the edge right behind the tires right here going back so you see where I have placed the jack stand come to the side I even took the wheels off so you can see exactly where I have the jack stands placed right on the chassis this section this area right here is attached to the main chassis right there it's a big beefy piece of metal that goes all around and goes across. Pretty much that's where you place your jack stands. One on this side and one on the other side. Man, I wish somebody had made a video on this as I was trying to figure out how to properly jack this car up. And I also have uh, and I also did the front, which I will show you right after this one. But uh, I hope this video is helpful, useful. It's uh, be be safe when you work on your cars. Again, going back under, jack it properly. As you can see, one is right there. One stand, one stand on the other side as I showed you earlier. The trick to lift the car up the first time is that differential plate. But again, I have the jack stands. The entire car is sitting on the jack stand. But I'm also leaving this jack, hydraulic jack, right here just to be on the safe side. Again, it's only 30-40% sitting on the hydraulic lift or jack. The rest of the car it's just sitting on the stands. And I will show you how to do the front. I'm gonna show you how to do it. First and foremost, the most important part, how to properly jack your car. Be very careful, do it right. I'm gonna show you how to do it, where to put the jack points. Simply, go under the car. That's the proper way to put it. Put your jack, that's the actual frame or the the actual support where the mount the engine mounts are sitting on right next to the oil pan as you see be very careful don't damage the oil pan put your jack right there lift up the car and as you can see I have two jack stands three ton each 
And the proper way to do it is, first you lift up the car completely, you put your jack stand on each side, adjust them properly, and place them in the right place, right there. Those are your jack points or jack stand points. One on this side, one on the other side. Align them, make sure uh, they're all sitting correctly in the right place, and then slowly bring your jack down and let the car sit on sit on your stand. I have the jack on there just in case for safety, uh, but this is the proper way to lift up the car.